Hey guys, welcome to Delightfully Diffused. My name is Paula, and today I am diffusing lemon, oops, lavender, and peppermint. It's that time of the year and you need some seasonal support. These are your go-tos. Today's video, we are going to be making a boo-boo spray. Boo-boo spray is for boo-boos. Okay, so like I said, we're gonna make a boo-boo spray. Why do you need that? Well, if you're at your family's house or at your, you're at the park and your kid gets scraped or hurts themselves on the slide and they have a little boo-boo, boo-boo spray to the rescue. This stuff is awesome, guys. And the kids don't cry. So now we're gonna make it. What do you need to make the boo-boo spray? You need lavender, you need frankincense, and then you need tea tree. Of course, you need a spray bottle. You need witch hazel. You don't wanna use alcohol because that's gonna be too harsh. It's gonna sting, you don't want it to sting, so you're gonna use witch hazel. And then you need distilled or filtered water. And I'm using my little diffuser cup because it's gonna be easy to pour. This recipe is super easy. So it's 10 drops of each oil. We're gonna start with lavender. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And if you get more in there, you get more in there, it's not a big deal. Now we're gonna use frankincense. Lavender is good for cleaning the boo-boos. Frankincense is great for soothing and healing. We're gonna do 10 of frankincense, maybe. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Okay. And if you wanna know more about what each of these oils do, this is when having a reference guide comes in really handy because it'll tell you things that I can't. So now we're gonna do 10 of tea tree. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. And each of these oils has properties to help cleanse the skin and to protect it and soothe it and all of that fun stuff. Now we're going to use witch hazel. And you're not gonna put very much in, I don't know if you can see, but there's not a whole lot of oil in there. And you're gonna put about two tablespoons, and I'm not gonna measure, no need, um, about two tablespoons worth, maybe, one as I look so about like that that's about up to there oh about up to there with witch hazel give it a little swirl and that's going to mix everything together now the reason you need the witch hazel is um because water and oil doesn't mix. So when you add the witch hazel, it blends them together and it helps uh, circulate them through the water so that they mix. Now you're just gonna fill the water to about the shoulder. That's what that's called, this little round area. Right about there. I'm actually going just under top on again give it a little swirl you don't want to shake it because if you shake it then you're introducing air into the bottle 
and that's going to break down the oils quicker. And you don't want that, you want it to last long. So if you just swirl it, you're not introducing a ton of air. So interesting little science behind that. So now you'll see it's kind of, I don't know if you can see that, you'll see it's kind of starting to mix. And you do want to shake it or swirl it before every use, um, just to make sure it's all mixed in. So next step is making a label. I got these pretty little labels from Amazon and I will, I also got these bottles from Amazon. I will leave a link in the description so that you can get them yourself. All right, and this is called again, Boo Boo Spray. So we're going to put, voila, Boo Boo. All right, so that's Boo Boo Spray. That's it guys, it's that simple. Um, it's one of the reasons why I like DIY. They're super simple, super easy to do, um, and they're fun. You can do this with your kids. My kids just happen to not be home right now, otherwise they would have done this. So um, it's a lot of fun. So that's it guys, that is my um, Boo Boo Spray. And this I keep in my purse because my purse is with me wherever I go, even when I'm at home. So if you know something comes up, you just grab it out of the purse and give a spritz. So that's it. Um, you know, once you try this, please leave a comment on this video and let me know what you think. If you have a different recipe, feel free to comment that as well because I love trying new things. Don't forget, um, you can follow me on social media. You can find me on Facebook at facebook.com slash uh, delightfully diffused sorry <laughs> and then you can also find me on Instagram at delightfully underscore diffused don't forget give this video a big thumbs up and then don't forget to subscribe to the channel because you will be kept up to date with all the new videos that come out you'll never miss one and that's awesome so all right guys that is it and until next time keep diffusing I will see you later